What's up, superstars? Happy Wednesday, and welcome to 118 Degrees of Separation, a game that's both fine and dandy. If you're new to 118, this is how it works. You tell me who to draw next week, that person has to have a connection to who I'm drawing this week, and if I pick your suggestion, you win that drawing. Last week, we drew a most excellent Keanu Reeves. This week's winner is Zamboni thief Tony Black, who likes long walks on the beach, chicken wings, and Notre Dame football. Tony suggested that I draw George Carlin, who was in Bill and Ted's Excellent Adventure with Keanu Reeves. So congratulations, Tony. Winner, winner, chicken dinner. Now, I had so much trouble deciding this week that I actually set up brackets with your suggestions and enlisted the help of three friends in my board gaming group. I'm a big nerd, by the way. They all decided on someone different. Then I tried to use math. I calculated point values to everyone based on their bracket performance. Have you heard that I'm a big nerd? And then I ended up with a three-way tie. Eventually, I just decided to go with my heart, and it seems like such an obvious pick, but Mr. Carlin also seems like he'd make a great drawing. I also kind of suspect that Tony Black may have snuck into my house at night and sat by my bed whispering, George Carlin, George Carlin, George Carlin, all night long. It doesn't quite seem fair, but if he's going to go through those lengths to win, he might just deserve it. I had the pleasure of seeing a couple of George Carlin's live shows as an impressionable young man. And when I was going to art school in Pittsburgh, I would walk to Jerry's fine used records just about every week, and I'd often grab a George Carlin record. I believe I have all of his comedy albums somewhere. So I feel like I grew up with George. He was essentially my goofy uncle that taught me all the language my parents didn't want me to hear. But my favorite might be his analysis of baseball and football. I also love that he was the very first host of Saturday Night Live. But enough yapping about myself. If you want to play 118, all you have to do is pick someone who's been in something with George Carlin and leave a comment. Details are in the description below, and if you don't want to weed through all the comments, check the pinned comment to make sure that you're suggesting someone new. This week might be a little difficult because Carlin was more of a comedian than an actor, obviously, but I have faith in you. There's Georgie boy. Thanks again, Tony, for the outstanding suggestion. I'll get this to you as soon as I can. That is, if you have a place for this stuff. Thanks, everybody, for participating. You blew me away yet again. I wish I could draw all of your suggestions, but keep them coming in the comments, and good luck. Here's Henry. I mean, this guy's amazing. If you're not sub to him, you're a doofus. Um, and then you won't be once you do.